We're going to continue from the previous video where we had made this simple timeline. We're going to customize this a little bit. So when I have my layer selected, you'll see that Dia has also added itself to the sketch inspector over here. And it gives you the ability to edit the timeline. So let's click on that. And that brings up this timeline view. And uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to have these boxes move one after the other rather than all together. So let's stagger these transitions a little bit by moving them that way. And now when you look at the preview, see that they move one after another. We can also customize the easing by double clicking on a transition. We get a curve editor. So whatever easing you want to choose you can go for it here or you can also use from presets like maybe an ease in cubic and it will set those values for you if you want you can also go for a spring if you want to keep it a little bit more springy that's possible for now let's just go with this curve and we're going to rebuild this to get the latest values click on this rebuild and you'll see that the third one moved differently, this red one. So once you're done with the timeline, click on Save and Close, and you're done.